Picture a world where time stands still and history seeps from every stone. Welcome to the cradle of civilization, the Middle East. Here, ancient civilizations left their indelible marks, their cultures woven into the fabric of time. Their architectural prowess stands as silent testimonies, etched in stone, whispering tales of their historical significance. These olden civilizations, rich in culture and heritage, laid the foundation for the world as we know it today. Now, let's embark on a journey back in time, to when these civilizations were at their zenith, through the ruins they left behind. Our journey begins with the magnificent ruins of Palmyra and Baalbek, remnants of the once mighty Roman Empire. Both cities, blossoming under Roman rule, were pivotal in the empire's eastern expansion. Next, we travel to Persepolis, the ceremonial capital of the Persian Empire, a symbol of ancient Iran's grandeur and sophistication. Our next stops, Petra and Jarash, showcase the architectural genius of the Nabataeans, a people known for their ability to carve cities into cliffs. From there, we journey to Basra, another marvel of Roman engineering, famous for its well-preserved Roman theater. We then venture into the Greek era, with Ephesus and Hierapolis, cities that echo tales of Greek mythology and philosophy. Our trip culminates in Tyre and Apamea, cities of the ancient Phoenician civilization, known for their maritime prowess and expansive trade networks. The ruins stand as silent witnesses to the grandeur of these ancient empires, each one a testament to the ingenuity and creativity of their builders. Each of these ruins carries a story, a piece of the puzzle that makes up our shared human history. Let's start with Palmyra, a jewel of the Syrian desert that was once a thriving caravan city. Its magnificent columns and archways tell tales of the prosperous Roman era. Next is Baalbek in Lebanon, home to some of the best preserved Roman temples. The grandeur of its architectural style is a testament to Rome's imperial ambitions. Then we have Persepolis, the ceremonial capital of ancient Persians. Its intricate reliefs display the Achaemenid style, showcasing the cultural diversity of the Persian Empire. Petra in Jordan, a city carved into rose-red cliffs, is a marvel of Nabataean engineering. Its rock-cut architecture is a symbol of the Nabataeans' mastery over their harsh desert environment. Jarash in Jordan gives us a glimpse of the grand Roman cities of the East. Its colonnaded streets and theaters are a testament to Rome's urban planning skills. Basra, another gem from Syria, was a key city of the Roman and Byzantine empires. Its well-preserved theater showcases the Romans' love for performance arts. Ephesus in Turkey was a Greek city famed for its Temple of Artemis. Its library, one of the largest of the ancient world, speaks volumes about the value Greeks placed on knowledge. Hierapolis, also in Turkey, was known for its thermal springs. The remains of its baths bear witness to the Romans' love for leisure and relaxation. Lastly, Tyre and Apamea, in Lebanon and Syria respectively, were key Mediterranean trade hubs. Their vast colonnades are a testament to their prosperity. These ruins, though silent, speak volumes about our past, reminding us of the enduring power of human ingenuity and resilience. These ruins are more than just stones, they are the enduring legacy of our ancestors.